What's up, y'all? Mr. J Rock 78 here, coming to you straight from the Midwest. And I am doing a video at Nocter Untoten on the World at War disc, the original test map, uh, zombies test map that they made. Uh, I have a previous video that has horrible uh, resolution, so I'm going to update it with uh, 720p and uh, I did make it to round 12 in that video uh, and that's the highest I've gotten in this uh, map here so we'll see what I can do today hopefully I will be able to uh, make it past round 12 but if not I will just have to go with that video wherever I die <clears throat> So I will start here waiting for the zombies to come through the barriers because I do want to get my drops and my max ammo on this pistol because as the rounds get higher you do get a lot of points for using the pistol and uh, I mainly use the pistol and knifing but if I have to I will go raid the mystery box for uh, something uh, a higher fire rate or the ray gun oh, he dropped quick I don't know what the hell happened there what is this guy doing Yes, I do rebuild the barriers just for the points. Uh, I love points. I want to get lots of points. No points there. And uh, I will open this door and eventually hold off into the back of that room by the back window because it does get a little chaotic and there is nowhere to really train in this area here because it is so tightly packed. But here we go on round two, so. I'm gonna not talk a lot because I can't talk and play video games at the same time because I am an idiot. And I will get stuck on everything and anything on the floor here for whatever reason. Door open. There we go. We can start off with the STG forty four, which is a automatic weapon. Double points. I don't want to miss my double points. It's round two. I will go turn this music box on like I do every time I play. Hopefully I can get a ray gun and some monkeys out of that uh, mystery box that will help me throughout the game. Ah, there goes my double points. Alright, now I will shut up and play because I need to concentrate on what I'm doing.
Okay, it was aiming at the zombie behind the one that was closest to me, so I don't know what happened there. This map is really hard. You have to continually watch your back because you do not know when they are coming up behind you unless you are looking behind yourself. Because the zombie sounds reverberate through the entire building. Now I will go rebuild my window back here because this is the only safety I have from the undead. <clears throat> and round four I will hit this mystery box again before they start spawning. Ah! I don't want that. Let me do it a sniper rifle. See, I will get caught on this crate because it is sticking out. And I do get caught on everything, like I had said before. I will probably end up buying the Thompson off of the wall. Kill. Yes, sir. Save ammo and knife on insta kill. Drops. That's what I always do. No! No, I don't want that. As you can see, it wiped out my entire uh, horde, so to speak, and I did not get any points. So I prefer not to get uh, nukes. And we are on round five. I should open this up again. MP40 will work too. So I will run this STG out of ammo. You're not coming through that wall. I can guarantee you that, buddy. This is my space, and you do not come into my space without getting your head blown off. Got it? See there, I did get caught on something at the uh, on the floor there. And if there are crawlers, I will get stuck on those, and they will take me down. Ah, max ammo. Yes, I was hoping I would get one of those. I'll grab that and continue killing. And we are done with round five. And now should begin chaos. <clears throat> 